Being a good designer has a lot to do with a person's talent and the sense of style. However, turning great ideas into great work requires the right tools and skills as well. Let's take a look at useful software for graphic designers and what makes them great. But before we get to that, make sure to hit the subscribe button so that you don't miss any of our videos. Pixelmator Pro. Pixelmator Pro comes with some brand new and smart image editing features that are all about innovation. The editing tools have been simplified, yet made more intuitive and more powerful. Thanks to that, this tool is quick and easy to use. Procreate. Procreate is an illustration app made specifically for the iPad. It is very intuitive and easy to use, and it simplifies the illustration process greatly. As a plus, it comes with a huge variety of brushes and options. Affinity Designer Affinity Designer is a great tool for creating vector-based art, developed to fit the needs of creative professionals. It is fast, smooth, and it comes with all the right features that every designer needs. Adobe Photoshop Adobe Photoshop is simply a must. There are thousands of tools and programs out there, but you should start with the basics and master Photoshop first. If you don't know how to use it, manipulating digital photos and creating pixel-based art will be so much more difficult than it should be. Adobe Illustrator When it comes to creating vector-based designs, Adobe Illustrator is the alpha and omega. From simple drawings through logos to photographs, Illustrator is the tool you will use more often than not. It might be a bit harder to truly master this tool, but it will definitely pay off once you do. Corel Draw Corel Draw is an app that has been around for over two decades. It comes with a variety of useful features for photo editing, illustration, print projects, typography, graphics, and more. GIMP GIMP is an image manipulation program available for GNU, Linux, OS X, Windows, and more operating systems. It is a free software ideal for graphic designers, photographers, illustrators, or even scientists. It comes with numerous customizations and third-party plugins which can help you enhance your productivity. We've seen software options. Let's take a look at hardware now. Surface Pro. The Microsoft Surface Pro is a tablet that can be turned into a powerful laptop-like device, and it is absolutely brilliant. The newest Surface Pro biggest pros are the hugely improved battery life, much better Surface Pen, and comfier, punchier type cover. Wacom Intuos Pen and Touch Wacom Intuos Pen and Touch was specifically designed for creativity. It comes with pressure-sensitive pen and multi-touch capabilities all in one small tablet. The results will show up on your computer screen, and if you run out of the drawing space, all you have to do is zoom in. Surface Studio Surface Studio comes with an awesome, thin, 28-inch pixel-sense display, 6th generation Intel Core i5 or i7 processor, a powerful NVIDIA GeForce GPU, and up to 32 gigabytes of RAM. The display features 192 DPI resolution, 10-point multi-touch, and 3 to 2 aspect ratio. Wacom Cintiq Pro Wacom Cintiq Pro resembles the feel of a pen and paper while reducing unwanted glare and reflections. The displays offer realistic colors up to 99% Adobe RGB, as well as a 4K resolution for more detailed view of your creations. iPad Pro While the other tablets mentioned here come with the pens you can use for your creations, you will have to purchase Apple Pencil separately if you want to turn your iPad into a design studio. However, once you do that, it will be worth it thanks to all the great features iPad Pro comes with, as well as the great performance and accuracy. Setup with multiple screens. Using more than one display can be great for multitasking and can really speed up your designing process. It is particularly useful when you work in a full screen mode app. A good keyboard and mouse. It might not sound as important as the other things on this list, but having a good keyboard and mouse can make your work much more enjoyable. When picking a mouse, choose the one that fits your hand and comes with the functionalities you need. As for the keyboard, choose the one that comes in the right size for you and feels good under your fingers. If you think we missed something, let us know in the comments section below. 
If you enjoyed this video, hit the like button. Don't want to miss the next video? Hit the subscribe button and click the bell beside it. Thank you for watching and check out these neat videos that we previously created.